my aim is to get back at the end of November and maybe the FA Cup week. Last night was awful, as you can see. I fell asleep at 2 and woke up at 9, but in between it was awful. 30% recovery in the red zone. I think I was dreaming I was kicking the football and woke up by kicking out of my left leg in the brace and it straightened and, yeah, it woke me up in pain. Yeah, not the greatest night's sleep, but I couldn't recommend this band enough. I've had it for six months now and I live by it. It literally tells me everything I need to know. So, fingers crossed, I can get a good night's sleep tonight and my recovery is spot on and I can get back in the green zone. Um, if you're interested, just have a little look in the description below. Um, I put the link in and yeah, you can do a bit of research for yourself. Things I'm taking right now is a turmeric shot. I started taking it a few years back and there's numerous health benefits to it. And right now it's a good anti inflam for myself while I'm injured. Uh, I started taking collagen mainly to help my tendon repair and it's very good for joints, skin, nails, etc. A lot more research on it if you search it up. Tablets, these are aspirins. I have to take two in the morning to prevent my blood clots from the surgery uh these are the painkillers at night so if i can't sleep take two of those and yeah should knock me out um the basic paracetamol and and then yeah the anti-inflammatories and that's what i've got to take for the next couple of weeks this is day three after surgery and as you can see yeah i'm heading to the apartment the gym very basic gym but i just gotta get out of the apartment and do something i feel a bit What's the word? I feel a bit lazy to just sitting down on my backside all day. I just feel I need to do something, get a bit of a sweat on, tick over and yeah, hopefully it'll actually release a lot of stress and tension. They changed the rounds since the last time I come in here, but yeah. Wait to it. I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. Yeah, I swear, I swear it was a bit better the last time I came in here. I usually use the Pewa Gym across the road, but just want to test it out to see how I work in this gym today. All right, let's crack on. Feel the matter now. Um, it's been like be two weeks tomorrow since I got my injury, which is absolutely crazy. Like how quick that's gone. Surgery was Tuesday. It is Friday today. I was stuck in the apartment way too long. I say too long, too long for me anyway. And uh, I needed to get out and do something. Yeah, that's why I came to the apartment gym. Did a bit of upper body. Got a little rowing session done at the end. Uh, one minute on, one minute off. But obviously I can only use my arms, I can't swing back and forth, I keep my leg bent. But uh, yeah, that feels good. Now i got a couple of things planned today. And now we're going to head back. Now we'll try and have a quick shower. And then I've got a business meeting. So trying to set some stuff up for after football and obviously doing football at the same time. In the short and double the money and long term, make much more. Yeah. So, um, so it's just, um, 
yeah, I, I think it's something that you've got an active interest in. So um, you, you've got to do a little bit of research. I don't think it's going to fail you, really. Because I said it's tender at all. Around. It was numb for a long time. Okay. Right. What about now? Can you feel now it? Really yeah, I can feel the skin. No, touch my skin. Is yeah. it sore? Uh, first two days, maybe. Okay. What about now? No, no, no. Okay, good. Looks really good. Yeah? Really, really good. No bleeding? No. It's good, isn't it? It's clean. Yeah, go first. Oh, no, I'm not asking it. <laughs> yeah, definitely still numb. Is it? Yeah. The soreness has gone? Yeah, the soreness has gone. Good. So there's no discharge coming out. You, the actual steri strips look very, very clean. There's no redness around the site either. So again, from an infection point of view, so, yeah, very, very good. Perfect. So obviously, the the more risk of infection would have been at the start, is it? Yes. But just after the surgery. Yeah. So but because really... the wound is still healing, you would still try and keep a very close okay. eye and try and yeah, yeah. still try and keep it as clean as possible until the wound's fully closed and healed. Yeah. That's when the risk starts okay. to reduce. But if the wound is still healing, it's in the active phase of healing. And there is still a risk of infection. Oh, okay. What's the chest today? I've not taken the steri strips off, so I'll leave them on. I can't until see it. Yeah. No, I'll, I'll leave them on until I've spoken to your yeah. surgeon on okay. Monday. Yeah. And then, depending on what they say in terms of which sutures there are, we'll then peel off the okay. steri strips. As you see in the video just now, uh, I had my stitches checked yesterday and the wound and everything is all clean, which is a good sign. Uh, no sign of infection or nothing. The only downside to it was the surgeon didn't put on it the day of the stitches that need to be removed, which is normally between 7 to 10 days. So I was planning on going home today and yeah, I have to wait now until tomorrow, Monday, to find out exactly when I can go home and just spend some time with the family. I didn't really record much yesterday because I I haven't been out for a while, like, you know, seen a lot of people, so it was actually nice to speak to people and actually be off my phone type of thing. Just wanted to make sure I enjoyed it. But the plan forward, I'm hoping I can get my stitches out Tuesday and then I can go home pretty much then get a week at home and recover and then the time I come back I will I should be out of the brace because yeah thought the boys were excellent yesterday I think it's going to be a good season this year well really hoping so just the style of football is entertaining everything the fans will enjoy it it seemed like I don't know I just it had a different atmosphere yesterday in the stadium and I feel like it's a positive vibe going around the whole club it feels like it's togetherness this year and hopefully I can be a part of it as soon as possible so my aim is to get back at the end of November and maybe the FA Cup week and hopefully then the boys will put themselves in a good position where I can just help them strive to the goals we want to achieve yeah another week or two in the brace and then I can crack on then so hopefully by the end of this week now I'll be able to go home see my wife and uh, see my dogs and then also see my friends and some family as well. So, and also get a nice little trim because hair's growing. Just got the phone to the dock now, and good news, the stitches are internal. That means that they'll dissolve. Gonna do a gym session now with the SNC coach. Yeah, I'm looking forward to it to be honest because it's just the first time to do a proper session and I'm excited about it. <laughs> but also I'm excited to go home now. So yeah, getting the dressing uh, changed again today and then I got two weeks of not, not having to take the dressing off. Good shit. Good. Nice big man. Try that elbow, elbow.
So we've just taken the dressing off. Um, looks very healthy around the steri strips. They look clean. There's no signs of infection. So we'll redress it again. And then see in a couple of weeks where we're up to.